Muitíssimo obrigado. É, boa tarde. Many thanks. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, your most excellent uh, mayors present here. Authorities present, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, I wish to thank, on behalf of my country, and the city of Matole, uh, the Vatican for the invitation extended, and state that it is a great honor for Mozambique and the city of Matola, which I represent here. I wanted to thank the Vatican for the important uh, role which it's had uh, in uh, establishing peace in Mozambique, which has now been um, established for many years. Mozambique had, uh, in 1998, the honor of receiving John at the time of the Rome negotiations and the peace treaty in my country was signed in this uh, city and its uh, peace which has lasted for more than 20 years. The topic chosen for the debate is very important for the whole world and particularly for cities for the following reasons. The um, climate change and modern slavery is um, a coupling which uh, has an effect on the lives of people in cities. It's important that in cities economic systems are resilient because everyone will need to adapt to the new situations. The inhabitants of the new um, cities in particular, the increase of the world population in cities will be a major challenge for uh, education, health, infrastructures, and um, security, just to quote a number of uh, points. I'd also like to thank the World Bank, which has funded projects in my country, and currently we are improving the situation in cities. We're opening new natural channels for water, which will be um, distributed in uh, a number of cities. This um, issue raises a number of problems in Mozambique, and in particular the city of Matola. These problems have exacerbated the vulnerability of the citizens, um, causing them to plunge even further into uh, modern poverty and slavery. In our country, there are many concerns, and certainly uh, this is a problem which will be addressed in the national legal framework. Our legal, criminal legal system uh, obviously has very severe punishments for any form of human trafficking and therefore the role of moralization of the church which requires that people live in a um, fairer society is very important therefore we join our voice to the voice of all those who speak of this problem particularly with regard to the role of cities which uh, will need to promote a more sustainable um, type of quality of life. We're all the same. There can be some differences with regard to the color of our skins, but the blood in our is red in all cases. We're very worried uh, with these aspects. On the 25th took part in the 15th annual conference of the Assembly of Members of the International Observatory on uh, Participatory Democracy held in the Georges Belenga room in the um, Palacio Sibelis in uh, Madrid. This is um, a meeting which uh, appoints the, um, the president uh, and the president uh, takes on his uh, position for the following year after this uh, assembly and uh, obviously he had to um, organize the new conference of the IODP. We'd like to express our thanks for the cooperation we have with Brazilian cities 
who which part of this um, international organization we obviously want to share uh, the organization of the 16 meeting of the IODP in Africa in Mozambique and specifically the province of Maputo in the city of uh, Mantola. Uh, for those of you who don't know our country, I'd like to remind you that uh, President Mandela married in our country because it's very close to South Africa. The International Observatory on Democracy, Participatory Democracy brings together 73 countries with uh, local and regional governments, international organizations, associations, research, academic, civil society organizations, and, in and other um, centers. This is the um, the issues we've been discussing uh, also going to be major issues um, discussed by the IODP and this uh, will change the uh, traditional approach and uh, will make uh, Matola for this period to be the capital of participatory democracy. It will be a historic uh, moment for Africa and it will be an event with an African uh, taste with lots of hospitality, solidarity, and dialogue, and it will be held from the 4th to 6th of May 2016. The main topic will be good governance and inclusive participation uh, of the population. So, if we weren't here to speak of uh, this subject, we wouldn't have uh, good uh, governance looking to the future and uh, trying to solve the problems at the root of these issues. We know that uh, things of this nature have an effect on the world economy, but we have to deal with this issue. We have to be brave enough to understand what's happening. We've seen the um, witness given by two people this morning, so we have to move from participatory democracy and local governance um, are very important local and uh, worldwide in uh, internet participation uh, participatory budgets and social inclusion and uh, control of the future I would like to thank the various uh, Brazilian cities Porto Alegre, Canoche, Porto and all the other cities uh, who, which have um, spoken of this uh, participatory budget. The levels of satisfaction of citizens have to be uh, sought in this uh, new work of ours, and therefore local organizations must be very important, must be given a very important role. And uh, here I'd like to take uh, the advantage of this event in order to invite all those present to for this conference in order to bring their experience and contribute to uh, better understand international democracies uh, in our country too and therefore uh, from the 4th to the 6th of May 2016 all roads lead to Matola a city in Mozambique and uh, as I said it's no coincidence that Nelson Mandela came to marry in this country in this city. I'd also like to take this opportunity to to distribute uh, a leaflet uh, discussing this uh, event and its event for the eminent um, members uh, uh, of this uh, meeting, inviting them to come to our country and take part in that meeting. Many thanks. Uh,